Michelle Young Cho and I'm with IDEA TV. And right now we're with Larissa Lam. Hi. Hey, girlfriend. <laughs> <laughs> it's so good to see you. What are you doing here? Well, I'm actually one of the contributing offers for me so for life, and I'm actually going to be performing later here as well. So it's pretty exciting. So how does it feel to um, be part of a melting pot of thoughts as a writer and a singer? You know, I actually, uh, I love to write and I actually was very honored when they asked me to write something because normally I'm a musician or, you know, I'm acting and so nobody ever asked me to write anything and so I got to actually write a story about um, my uh, three generations, about my father coming to the United States and just kind of how his father disapproved of him going to, to, to the entertainment industry but yet my father was able to kind of start anew in the U.S. and, and be able to encourage me and my dreams in, in the arts so it's, it's kind of a cool story. So what's the title of your story? Um, it's a father's daughter. <laughs> it's very simple. <laughs> so, do you feel like you are definitely a father's daughter? Yes, I'm definitely <laughs> daddy's little girl. Absolutely. <laughs> you know, I was very blessed because I know in an Asian culture, there's the whole stereotype of a you know distant father, and I'm probably one of the few. Um, people growing up Asian that had a very loving, very close relationship with a father and I think that that's actually made a huge impact in, in my success. Is your father here today? He actually isn't. He wanted to be here but um, he isn't. <laughs> Um, I, I think I saw a very uh, good-looking man by you. Who is it? <laughs> oh, good-looking man must be my husband, only one rapper extraordinaire. <laughs> He's going to be joining me on stage a little bit later, too. Okay. So what uh, songs are you guys um, doing tonight? It's a surprise. No. Um, <laughs> we're going to be doing a couple of original songs, um, maybe busting out a Christmas song. Uh, we're going to do our, our very popular parody of American Boy, Cantonese Boy. And uh, we're just going to hopefully rock out the house. Our band is here, too, so it's going to be loud. <laughs> okay, thank you so very much, and I hope you rock us all out. <laughs> Absolutely, thank you.